This video will demonstrate how to create a crossword puzzle online with a program called Crossword Labs. Well, this is a free website called CrosswordLabs.com. And on this website, it allows you to create free crossword puzzles and um, gives you some different options for presenting those to your students. So I'm just using the free version, but they do have the ability for you to create an account. Um, if you create an account, um, it's $9.95 for a lifetime membership. It basically allows you to manage the crosswords um, that you create. But the free version I found is, um, is enough for what I would need. So let's say that I'm going to create a crossword puzzle um, if I'm helping students study for the planets. So I would just enter in a title of the crossword. And then the next uh, larger box here tells me to enter the word, which is basically the answer, um, put in a space, and then add the clue or the question um, that students will have to guess what the answer is. So I'm just going to quickly um, put in the, uh, the answer and my questions. So I have about um, eight questions here, or answers lined up with uh, eight different questions. Um, at the bottom here, I can create a passcode which allows me to protect the answer key. Um, so I'm just going to quickly enter um, a passcode. And then with that passcode, I'll click Generate. The next screen shows you what the crossword puzzle will look like for your students. So it shows the layout, your across questions, and your down questions. If you need to edit, you can go ahead and edit. Otherwise, simply click Save. After you click Save, it'll give the crossword puzzle a URL, which is the address of that crossword puzzle. So right here, if I wanted my students to complete this crossword puzzle online, I would share with them this address. So I could put that on my Moodle page or my website or anything like that if I wanted them to create it online and they would be able to give me their answers online. Um, the, the other option though, and probably the option that most teachers would use, would be to print out either a PDF or a Word document. So if I click on PDF, that will bring up the PDF document of that crossword puzzle which I could uh, simply print out and hand out to the students for a study guide. The Word document button would, uh, would work the same way. Of course with that, the nice part about that is I would be able to um, do some editing on that Word document. As a teacher, if I want to see the answer key, I can just simply click on answer key and it'll ask me for the passcode of that crossword puzzle. So again, if students click on that link, they won't be able to see the answer key unless they know what the passcode is. And then it'll show me a PDF of the answer key, which of course I can print out or I can click save if I want to save that for my records. This video demonstrated how to create a crossword puzzle with the online tool called crosswordlabs.com.